As you can see, the expiry date is 2016, November 2016, and it was probably manufactured somewhere in 2013. So it's 10 years old and the oil looks What's up folks, it's Uranus from Brussels. Welcome to another video. Did you ever wonder how testosterone ages? Well, you're about to find out today. I recently cleaned my freaking car and I found some testosterone replacement therapy I bought almost a decade ago and I forgot in my glove box. Yeah, I don't clean my car inside very often as you can hear. So let's get to it and let's see what testosterone looks like after a freaking decade in a car. So I recently found some Sustanon that has been in my car for a very, very long time. This is the box in question. I was prescribed Sustanon in 2014, at the end of 2014. That's where I freaking bought it in the pharmacy. I switched to HCG monotherapy after that and I kept my testosterone as backup plan and I always left it in my car just in the case I needed to go somewhere and I needed to have testosterone on the go. Now in the meantime, it stayed in my car for all that period. The shelf life is until 2016. I bought it in 2014, so it was probably manufactured in 2013. So here is the ample of Sustanon. It's pharma grade, of course. So this thing has been exposed to extreme temperatures for almost a decade. During the winter, my car was always outside, so it was exposed to temperatures up to minus 10 degrees Celsius, so it was probably frozen over and over again every day during the winter months and then during the summer months it was exposed to extremely high temperatures. I remember I used to go to France on holiday to the south of France in the Provence with my car and this thing has always been in my glove box. Now in those regions it easily reaches 40 degrees Celsius outside and so in the sun i bet in my car it probably was around 60 degrees and as you can see from this video the ample the oil hasn't changed whatsoever in almost a freaking decade it looks brand new now as you can see the expiry date is 2016 november 2016 and it was probably manufactured somewhere in 2013 so it's 10 years old and the oil looks brand new. Of course, I specify this is pharma grade. I've never bought any testosterone from any other source than a pharmacy with a prescription. And this is just to show you how good this thing still looks after a decade. On the left, you can see an ampoule of testosterone enantat that I recently bought. It was manufactured last year in 2022 and it pretty much looks exactly the same. If I peel off the label from the Sustanon, it wouldn't be differentiable from the one from the other. They look identical, so it aged really, really well. I very often see posts on Reddit of guys asking if it's normal that their testosterone is crystallizing or the color is changing or it has a weird aspect so if there, there's a bubble in it, it's not transparent, the oil looks weird and so on. And I pretty much think that's all because it's made somewhere in an underground lab in India or whatever, because as you can see here, pharma grade testosterone ages really well. Now, since it's overdue since the past seven years, I'm never going to inject this shit into me, but it's still interesting to see how good it ages because the oil looks immaculate. It looks pretty much like the very first day I bought it. Personally, I've only used testosterone that was prescribed by a doctor and made by a pharma grade uh, company. Now always be careful of what you buy online and what you inject into you because you could end up with an abscess or you could end up with even worse than that. Recently I saw some guys that had necrosis on their freaking injection site because they injected bad gear. So now you know how testosterone ages, how pharma grade testosterone ages after 10 years in a car exposed to the heat of the summer exposed to the cold. There's not even any discoloration, nothing changed to the ampoule. If I remove the peel, it could use, it could look exactly like recent pharma grade testosterone. All right, leave me a comment to support my channel, subscribe. I will catch you on the next one. Uranus out.